While Realme UI is a great improvement over ColorOS, many of us still want to flash custom ROM and get that pure stock experience. Okay, before now you had to downgrade to ColorOS because all other custom ROM were based on Android 9, but right now it has all changed. Let me show you how to flash custom ROM based on Android 10. <laughs> Okay, welcome back again to Smart Depot today. If this is your first time of being here watching our video or you just like our video, please click on that subscribe button right now because we are going to be doing a phone giveaway once we hit 3k subscribers and it's very close. So make sure you turn on the notification bell icon to get information when we you know do that. So we'll start with those who still have locked bootloader. Um, there are requirements here. You need a PC, ADB and fast boot drivers and in-depth test app so I, I done a full video on that uh, this is platform tools uh, from Google you can either use platform tools from Google or you can use install ADB and fastboot in 15 seconds whichever one we are using both of them will get the job done but I love this one because it automatically installs the drivers too then there is in-depth test app you apply if you review if you're successful then you start in-depth testing and it will take you to bootloader mode where you can do fast boots and other things like that so you have to confirm by typing fast boot devices to be sure that you know device is communicating well as you can see it's showing my device serial number in fast boot then you flash the code fast boot flashing unlock is the code to unlock but it won't unlock immediately to prompt you a uh, prompt unlock the bootloader do not unlock the bootloader use the volume button to select unlock the bootloader the one below and use the power button to hit mind you it will wipe everything in your phone so make sure you've done your backups before unlocking bootloader so um after that right now we're going to flash vb meta and and um we're going to flash custom recovery so with this two right now we are going to be able to flash custom rom you can still check out that video i did before in the cards and in the how to actually do this if you want to go into details so right now we have unlocked right now and we have flashed our recovery so what we're going to do is we're going to put into the recovery you can also manually boot into the recovery by pressing the volume down and power button use the volume to select recovery and use the power to hit enter and bam you are in the recovery so the first rule you're going to do is to back up everything now do not forget this now this saved me because while i was tinkering and trying out a lot of things i break the phone but my backup of especially the persist partition persist partition is very unique even if you go to <laughs> service center they can't flash your persist partition is unique with your device we are every calibration every unique setting with the device are stored and it's different from one person to the other so make sure that you back up all your partition this thing really 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 helped me so once you've done copy it to a very very safe place and let's get ready to flash so, so flash we're going to wipe some things we're going to wipe david catch uh, data system vendor now vendor is a kind of tricky one the rom i'm going to flash now has a custom vendor it was still in the test mode so that's why i wiped vendor but uh, i would encourage you to wipe vendor just wipe system cache data and then leave vendor because even if it's um even if the rom has a custom vendor it will actually patch the vendor partition so uh, do not remove the vendor so let me use this opportunity to talk about android 10 base and android 9 base now some roms especially the old older roms before now are based on android 9 uh, that is color os so they will work with color os vendor to be able to work so but now due to you know developments and other you know developments kicking in now custom roms right now are based or rebasing to android 10 whereby you can now straight from Remi ui you don't need to downgrade again to color os the reason for that is that Remi didn't actually you know support developers they didn't give out those devices for developers to work with there is no flash tool so these developers are doing wonders so they had to work with android 9 and use it to you know create custom runs for android 10 but right now developers are growing you know development is kicking faster right now with Remi x2 so uh they have now rebased android 10 and most of the box right now the wi-fi displays 
and a whole lot of them has been dealt with right now nfc everything is working right now in most of this custom rom rebased on android 10 so i'll be doing some of the reviews of that and remember i talked about the vendor image so if you are using vendor image from Remy UI, you don't need to wipe it out because if you do, some things might not work properly. So that's just the thing. So allow the vendor image wipe system, data cache and all the stuff. So this was a test build. Uh, this was initial test build for um, loss uh, lineage OS. As you can see here, the, uh, the fingerprint wasn't working. So I reported back to the developer and the developer fixed it and everything is working perfectly right now. I mean, it's bugless. Everything is working. So to check out, you know, whether my <laughs> device is still working. So I had to flash an under Android 10 based, uh, which was a test build then also. Um, I had to reflash uh, Pixel experience. And as you can see right now, the fingerprint is working on pixel experience so mind you that before you flash any custom you know rom right now you have to ask question you have to know which base is it based on android 9 or is it based on android 10 if you are on android 9 and you flash android 10 based custom rom it will not work so make sure you keep that at the back of your mind uh, so that will be almost about it for now remember you need to subscribe because our giveaway is coming soon and turn on notification bell icon and i'll see you in the next video peace